Yeah, there is. There was one right here. Whoops. Well, let's get Gumbella out. This winding stair, uh, this winding stair. That doesn't, that doesn't seem right. Shouldn't it say stairs? This winding stairs leads up to the belfry. Talk about a doozy of a climb. I mean, it's almost like the staircase is saying, go away, I totally hate you. I feel like I should say, like, should have said, like, staircase or something, you know? Like, I don't know. Again, comes off as weird. Hey, hang on there, Slick. Oh, he still says it. What are you doing interrupting my me time? Well, come on. This guy is the monster the mayor is freaking out about? Who, who are you calling a monster? What's your problem? Why do you need to pick a fight? I'm busy thinking up new pranks and stuff. It's not easy either. Now get lost. Of course you guys won't. No way you ninnies go away quietly. Am I right? I love Duplis. <laughs> well, alright then, Slick. Fine. Yes, I turned the villagers into pigs. Big deal. Big deal? You stink, mister. You don't want to turn them... Why do you want to turn them pigs anyway? Well, you know, they're all so depressing and boring and dim-witted all the time. So instead of wallowing in gloom, I figured they might as well as wallow in mud. Huh. Now they're pigs, get it? Isn't that just so perfect? It's like irony or something. So what, you got a problem with that? I guess you do, so let's play slick. Oh, he told me it's bizarre. This thing isn't listed in here. There's a monster in here that looks like this thing, but it doesn't give a name. Max HP is 40, attack is 4, and defense 0. It's apparently really good at transforming itself into other things. Maybe use that power to turn the villagers into pigs. This thing is a real jerk. Yuck, yuck, yuck. I guess I'll get down and dirty if you're going to play like that, Slick. I eat. Try this tornado jump. Oh, okay. I see what it's gonna do. It's gonna give me commands to execute. I should have been a little more patient. Let's try that one more time. Sorry. I don't know why I was confused there. What? Was I supposed to hit A? <laughs> was I supposed to hit A at the end of that? <laughs>
Hmm, time to regroup here. So you think you're a couple of heavies, huh? Well then, my dear friends, if you thought changing folks into pigs was impressive, then you're gonna love this. I've got something very special for you here. How do you like them apples? Now that's magic, people. Now you're fighting yourself. Ha, huh, I'm damn genius. Even like the, how the sound is off on it. Okay, we're not gonna do the tornado jump again. I don't need something that's that complicated. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Hold on. What? Huh? You beat me? Got a crystal star. I love the fake out so much. And I know I'm spoiling this ahead of time. Mario defeated the scourge of Creepy Sibyl and found the fourth crystal star. The people of Twilight Town have surely recovered from their awful curse by now. At this rate, Mario's quest to collect all seven stars will be done in no time. With his back to creepy, oh, with his back to creepy steeple, Mario sets out towards his bright future. But we cut back to this instead. That's it. That's all you got, man. This guy was a wimp. That wasn't even fair. Well, who cares, right? We got the crystal star, so let's get out of here. It's like, huh? This is, like, one of those things that, like, is easily why I think this is, like, the best chapter in the game. I mean, obviously, the music and the atmosphere not being as strong as the original, I think, hurts this chapter. But, like, this moment, this moment is still why I think this chapter is, like, one of the best in here. And makes up for a lot of the, uh, issues with this chapter. Definitely got to heal. Because to lose all your partners just like that. To take away so much from you. Is, uh, it's great. <laughs> yes. This time we'll take that Mario and get this map. With this super bomb here, there's no way we can fail. No, no, not likely. Gah. Vivian, hand me the gl that glory super bomb. Huh? Vivian, don't you dare. Does that huh mean what I think it does? I never had it. You were holding it you, just two seconds ago. You said it was too important to trust with me. If you trust with me, yeah, to trust me with. Oh, you terrible liar. Stop making up stories to cover yourself. If, if I don't have it, then obviously you must have it. And obviously you lost it. Or are you trying to imply that I lost it, you little loggly gagging worm? No, of course not, Beldam. Well, we can't do much without it now, can we? Oh, you're such an idiot. Very well. Sure, you must have dropped it around here somewhere. So why don't you look for it while Marilyn and I go take a well-earned siesta? 
And if you don't find it, well, you know what'll happen, don't you? I get punished. That's right, you little twit. So get cracking. Come here, Ian. Let's leave this useless little fool to her chore. Go ho. Nineteen damage. Oh, my lord. Oh, you're not gonna attack again, are you? Okay, good, you're running. <laughs> See, I considered healing. I considered healing because I was kind of afraid she might attack again, but she decided to run away, which, thank god. We're gonna go back and heal, uh, use the heal block just because of that. Like, oh my lord. Do we still have. No, oh, it didn't respawn. So, the OG of this game. This chapter has a lot of back and forth between this, the Creepy Steeple, and Twilight Town. I think it's like a total of like four times you're kind of going back and forth or something like that. And considering you're stuck on these narrow pathways, uh, that makes it really hard to avoid enemies. It becomes a bit annoying, a bit of a chore to do the, to make the trip over and over and over again. Okay, I think we should just use Quake Hammer. You know, I did not mean to do that. I honestly, I might run from some of these fights because I uh, don't necessarily want to deal with them as Mario by himself. It's really hard to dodge them when you're stuck on these narrow pathways. lot easier to max out. I don't know if it's just, like, I've only done it twice, so. Also, I'm not losing coins. I'm not sure if, like, why that was changed. I don't know if the game gives you, like, a freebie here and there. This music's different, isn't it? 